that 2K land, man. Y'all already know what time it is, man. Check this out. I know y'all love these videos, man. I love bringing them to y'all, man. We're going to be bringing the news. Some Okay, so check this out. Over the next couple of weeks, we're going to be trying out some new formats and things like that. We're going to be dropping longer videos, shorter videos. We're trying to get with, with T. Misley. Uh, Brutal Sim, Anonymous 2K TV. We're going to be trying to do some segments and stuff. We're going to be doing interviews. And the main thing that's coming this year is Sub Wars since we got the cross platform play. It's going to be dope, man. So make sure y'all lock it to this channel. And if anybody try to do Sub Wars, you just let them know that they stole it from your boy because that's all they, that's all people do. Come down here and they mull around with us and they steal stuff. But let me tell y'all, look, we're going to get into all this stuff in one second, man. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video and comment y'all thoughts down below. Y'all might want to know what this shirt is I'm wearing, man. Check this out. P-R or E-R. Check it out. Hey, hey, give me my personal record or give me death. Hey, it is what it is, man. Also, we went to see the Ninja Turtles today, man. Y'all can't see it, but but check, bro. Hey, I got the, the, the popcorn joint. Obviously, that says Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles right there, TMNT. And it says the, uh, what did it say? Mutant Mayhem. Listen, man, boy, me and grown men ain't nothing but boys with money. That's all we is. Hey, I even got my boy Donatello right here. Y'all can't see it, but I got the cup. I got everything, boy. I got Donatello. He even got him with the cute little glasses on. I'm going back. The cup's like $11, and you get a free drink with him. So, hey, I'm about to get all the cups, man. But, hey, we ain't talking about cups. I got to go see Oppenheimer. I got to take uh, Bridget. Bridget, you know, the wife, she, she want to see Barbie. Let me know if your wife would, duped you into going to see Barbie. That's number two. Number three, uh, you know, uh, LJ want to go see the teenage cracking. So we got a lot of movies to go see this weekend, but I get to see them all for free because, you know, I get I got the uh, movie pass. But anyway, last but not least, man, check this out. Get your tees and a breeze when you're rocking with breeze tees, man. Check this out. We got hats, custom hats, custom everything. Uh, we got the blessed designs. Hey, we got a lot of stuff. I'm going to be revamping the site, but the main thing about this site is, man, you can do Hey, we even got a new Gym Star shirt that we're gonna be putting up there. But you can really put anything that you want to up there, man. Hey, let's say it like this right here. You got, you know, you wanted to put your own PR or ER up there. Bow, 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 back it up. And then you can put it on there, man. Anything that you want. If you order the shirt this week, we will be getting it out tomorrow. And with all that out of the way, like I said, man, I appreciate y'all coming through, showing plenty of love and all that stuff, sitting through this stuff all the time because we got tons of 2K news for y'all right now now and it's coming straight from the guy hosting this twitter space right now we're not in the twitter space but <laughs> but, but hey check it out that boy j.a bridge fourth man he said listen man listen my guy it's worth noting according to some nba players who played nba 2k nba 2k 24 is not green or missed like it was in nba 2k 23 or at least on hall of fame play now okay it says you can choose where your shot feedback is and you can choose where your shot feedback is so that's dope right there and then like this is just something that he's saying this is brent z you know say 2k24 is not is not green or miss like it was in nba uh, like it was last year or at least in, in hall of fame play now nba source you can choose where your feet where your shot feedback is so that's cool i want none of my feet man so i can see because don't y'all hate like when you see it, you got to look up there and see what it is sometimes i took the shot i want to see it under my feet like that would be dope right there if you could do that right there so i can look at my guy see it see that i missed and i can see it immediately because sometimes you have to ask them guys was that late early or like what was that and then last but not least he said content creators let me know uh i got a lot of nba 2k news that y'all don't know about because i been kicking it with some of the nba players y'all want y'all want me to make a uh, space tonight whatever 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 now now i'm gonna tell you like this whether or not it's true is it doesn't matter to me because i want to pose a question out of this do you guys believe that we should go back to green or miss or i mean that we should go back to that we should not be on green or miss or do you think we should go back to green or miss i mean i mean keep keep green or miss to me it really doesn't matter and i'm gonna tell you why and uh and i and i got my proof and i got all the stuff behind it and stuff like that but the reason that i believe that it, it that it doesn't matter is because i feel like this is all they've done um they can leave it just like this because it's easier to green but the reason it's easier to green is they just took the green they just took the ones that would have been whites that would have gone in the whites that would have gone in they just um they just turn those green and like the game sees you know like when you shoot a white it, it, it kind of decides late if it's gonna go in or what have you and we're gonna show y'all this right here from my boy uh coyote where he's just gonna kind of break this down for y'all or whatever but uh y'all y'all will get to see it can i switch to this screen right here and then do it like this because i want y'all to hear what he's got to say and then uh 
you know, we, and we'll explain, you know, what's actually going on and why I feel like it's this way. But hey, talk to him, Coyote. You gotta do me a favor. Y'all gotta fix this shit, man. So that's what this is what the game does. Talk right? to him, Coyote. When you catch a shot that the game didn't think you were gonna catch, right? It's just a basic shot. I'm gonna walk up. You know what I'm saying? I shoot it. Now watch how I catch the bar. It's in there. It's, it's green. Cool. Is it? Look, it's not moving. It's in there. Right? It's in there. I caught it. But the game feels like, oh no, that's a shot he wasn't supposed to hit. Mm -hmm. So it corrects itself. Right. Look at the bar. Watch it's the bar. Frozen. It's there. Watch it jump back. Right when his feet hits the ground. No. Nope. that shit? Got him. Got him. <laughs> so that's what it is. If you catch a shot that the game don't feel, you should have caught in the green. It corrects itself at the last second and bounces off. Look at that shit. There we go. Look at that. Bounces off. But at the same time, it corrects itself at the last second and goes in as well. So, like, that's why I believe, like, the reason that 2K gave us delayed greens uh, this year, I, I think the delayed greens, I don't believe, I truly don't believe that delayed greens are something that they intended to put into the game. I think that, like I said, y'all know how this thing is. It's programming and it's math. And when you put enough programming and math into the game, you know how it's going to manifest itself. Because the whites decide that they're going to go in at a later time, or, or the game decides that a white was going to go in at a later time than um than than a green would like it knew a green was going to go in immediately but you know sometimes the guy would do the do the celebration or whatever when he did a white you know after it went in or what have you so the game is deciding later whether or not that ball is going to go in when you shoot a white and i think it's the same thing where they're turning the whites into greens so because it's going to decide later whether or not the shot is going to go in it probably manifested itself in 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 this late green animation or what have you and then so to fix it and make everything look uniform they just made all of them uh be late so if you shoot but they, but you know if you shoot a green on the game and it's a green as soon as you leave your hand you we, we know we know when we hit there you know we like it felt good he starts doing something you know if it, it feels a certain way when you know you hit it absolutely right but on those greens that you think that you might miss you like oh i don't know if i hit that one or not and then it turns green late you know it, it's always like he it, it, it's a little bit of delay to it i just feel like that that's just how the game manifested it and then the, the in 2k was like well you know we we can't have instant greens and late greens so we're just gonna turn it all to late greens um you know right before it goes in because once the game decides that the ball is gonna that it's gonna go in and that it's gonna be green you know what i'm saying like it decided it decides it late that was probably that 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 last shot right there was probably was probably a white let's see how it goes whoop and then he bounced, he lands flat footed. That was probably gonna be a white. And then it turned green right at the last second before it went in. Like I said, I don't, I don't think it's much, I don't think it's exactly like, um, like what they said, they just made it be like that for the more, for more uh, anticipation or, you know, just more so people wouldn't be running down court because we do that anyway, anyway. Uh, you know, they would go for rebounds and stuff like that, offensive rebounds, people just take off anyway. So that didn't help that. I just think that that's just the way that the game manifested. When you shoot a green, uh, when you shoot a green that that turned into a white, it's it it was like they they just saw it. Hey, dang, we getting these and this and that, and you know, and so that kind of goes into what I'm talking about right here. According to NBA 2K, uh, players who play the game early, the green animation in NBA 2K will have uh, will be the same as they were in NBA 2K23. Green releases will show right before the ball goes in. Greens are not instant and then like you said green releases show right before the ball goes in greens are not instant instant source nba and i totally believe that because like i said i just think that's just the way that the game manifested it when it decides that a white was is gonna go when it makes the decision that the white is gonna go in it was probably giving green animations at the end of that right there when it was just green or nothing because that's just how the game manifests itself because when you shoot a green if, if you're gonna turn it to green or nothing and then whites are gonna turn to greens then you're gonna see delayed greens uh, that's how this is how the programming was probably manifesting itself and then so they just said you know we're just going to lay all the greens and you when you shoot a pure green you do see it uh pop up there a little bit before a white that turned into a green too but i digress if y'all understand what i'm saying let me know what y'all know what i'm saying but i just think that it's just it's just one of those things where i think it's just going to be the same way i ain't got no problem with it because like i said to me it can be green or nothing or it can be 
like it was, but to me, it feels like it's just like it was where full bars that the game decide are gonna be green. I feel like I'm shooting at the same rate. And, and you know, my, my, shot, my shot selection and all of that may play some part in it, but I feel like I'm shooting, you know, about the same percentages. All the percentages are down across the board because they did make shooting harder across the board, especially at the beginning of the game. But we got used to it and now everybody's shooting regular. But it doesn't matter to me because like I said, I'm gonna shoot the absolute piss out of the ball anyway. It doesn't matter what they do. Every every 2K that not come with it and every 2K, I figured out a way to shoot the ball. You know, and, and this 2K, I'm probably gonna actually take a little bit seriously as far as like, uh, you know, trying to get better, you know, playing a little pro-am stuff like that. So we're gonna find, you know, we'll, we'll see how that goes, man. I might actually try to get better and do some stuff, but we're gonna get these sub wars popping and all that stuff, man. It's gonna be super dope. But let me know what you guys think down in the comment section. Does it really matter to you? Like I said, whether that information is true or not, the thing that matters is what do you guys think? Do you think it's gonna be better with green or nothing? Or do you feel like you hit more shots? I don't feel like I'll hit more shots with green or nothing. Or, or or with the uh, flexible release, you know, with the whites going in last year, hella whites. I don't feel like I hit more shots. I feel like I hit the same amount as I'm hitting this year, so it's not a big deal. But if they let whites go in, I'm the white walker. Y'all, hey, I've had entire gameplay sessions with T where I shot not one, not even one green, and literally every shot went in, and I could call that it went in because I knew you know, where I shot the ball, it was going to go in. So it's, it's not going to be any different. But let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ. Guys, please.